Horses grazing on a ryegrass field during the winter is a common scene. But like many things in life, too much of a good thing can lead to problems. Horses tend to overgraze because uh, the quality of the grass, the sugar content of the grass is much higher than what they're used to. Overgrazing on ryegrass can lead to health problems including colic or other intestinal issues. Owners also should look for signs of dehydration. In the summer, their forages or their pasture has 60 to 80 percent water content, but in the winter it can be decreased to only 15 percent. So an increased water consumption uh, is oftentimes necessary. Walker recommends that horses be turned out on pastures of ryegrass for about two hours per day to prevent overgrazing. When temperatures do turn frigid, the amount of hay fed to a horse needs to be increased. For every 10 degrees, it goes below 35 degrees, you need to increase the amount of hay you feed them by two pounds. Um, that's for an average 1,000 pound horse. Another area of concern is the horse's hooves. Winter precipitation can cause poor pasture conditions, leading to hoof problems. When their hooves are soft and they step on a rock or a pebble or something out in the pasture, uh, it can lead to abscesses fairly easily. Um, and abscesses are not the end of the world. They're, they're fairly common, fairly easy to manage, um, but they will make your horse very uncomfortable for a couple of days until it resolves itself. Walker says that winter is a great time to ride your horse, but allow the horse more time to recover because it is expending more energy to stay warm. With the LSU Ag Center, this is Craig Gotro reporting.